So, <clears throat> I want to take out some time here to hash out my concerns with leagues going forward. Obviously, leagues can uh, be described as many things. Um, some people call it fun. Some people call it grindy. Some people call it RNG. I'm going to call it a little bit of both. Or a little bit of all three. Um, it's fun. It's grindy. But more importantly than the other two, it's RNG. Um, the problem with that is, is how can you have a competition in which the top 1% get ranked Dragon based off of random number generation, not based off of skill? So, <clears throat> for instance, say, say you get really lucky at all things that have a low drop rate. But then you do horrible on all things that have a very high drop rate. So say, for instance, Corporal Beast. Um, say it takes you double the drop rate to get a, a Visage. Well, you put in way more hours than, say, somebody that gets lucky at Corporal Beast, but is unlucky at, say, <clears throat> Barrows, for instance. Um, obviously, the guy that got unlucky at borrow say it takes him two three times the drop rate it only costed him an extra half hour versus the guy at corp it costed him an extra you know 10 hours maybe i don't know exactly how many hours it would be but um quite a few hours extra um i think that's absolute garbage for any kind of competition um having rng involved um maybe make it Kind of like Vorkath going forward. Um, this is just kind of a shout out to Jigex. If they end up, someone ends up watching my video that has any influence there, maybe make the tournaments or these uh, competitions less RNG based. <clears throat> and what I mean by that is, is just add more tasks that don't include RNG, but more importantly, get rid of the ones that are currently in place. Just put KC up, you know? I mean, I don't think there'd be anybody that would complain that all the tasks, instead of being drops, turns into KC. Um, I think everybody would be much happier knowing that, hey, look, it's guaranteed points getting a certain drop. Yeah, going back to what I was saying, I don't think anybody would complain that, oh, I don't get points because I got a, a lucky drop. I don't think anybody complained. But where do you hear all the complaints currently right now? Think about it, JGX. Where Where are you hearing complaints? What are, what are people complaining about with leagues? What's the number one thing? RNG. Everybody's complaining about RNG. So why don't you fix that? You know, let's 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 work towards a solution. You know, um, hopefully hopefully somebody sees it or hears this video, sees this video, and um, maybe they could um throw some um feedback over to JGX because I don't think JGX is realizing or RuneScape, whoever you want to call it, <clears throat> is realizing like how impactful it can be um to, you know, have a um such an unfair advantage. You know, they talk about, you know, um people that are, you know, buying real world gold or um using cheat clients, bots, stuff like that. Um and those give unfair advantages. Well, wouldn't you be worried about the same unfair advantage given to players <clears throat> while they're playing in a game that's a competition? I mean, you know, like let's let's either get rid of the the um, RNG completely, or or figure out a solution where you can make it to where yeah, equipping you know, say a, a visage or a um, spectral shield or whatever is a task, but give it a guaranteed drop rate at whatever the drop rate is. So they have, you have a chance to get it early, but once they hit that drop rate, they automatically get the item. Um, and say it's something that drops multiple items, you know, say for instance, like, like Bandos, right? Say Bandos, you have four item, three items, is it? I think uh, Tacit's, Boots, and Top that are all the same drop rate, I think. Um, I could be wrong, but say for instance there, how you do it is you'd say, okay, you still have you have the same drop rate on all three items, but by the time you hit the drop rate, if 
you've gotten one of the items, um, you'd be fine. They wouldn't get a guaranteed drop rate. But say they hit double the drop rate and they still only have one item, they would automatically get one of the other two items. And it would never be a dupe. It would always be a different item than what they currently have. I think so many more people would be willing to compete in the leagues. And so many more people would also enjoy the leagues more. Um, maybe it's just me um, being overcritical about the RNG involved in it. But yeah, just, just my takeaway. Um, let me know how you guys feel in the comments below.